What is Dynagist? Now, Dynagist is a drug that is coming up in a big way in the management of endometriosis. Let's learn more about this drug as this is very important not just in your clinical practice but also very important for the postgraduates in their uh, practical exam. So, uh, Dynagist is a fourth generation progesterone uh, containing drug uh, which has 19 uh, not testosterone derivative. This has anti androgenic uh, effect and progesterogenic effect that means it increases the uh, progesterone receptor uh, expression in the endometrium and thus creates a pro progesterogenic environment uh, this is given in the dosage of 2 mg once daily for a span of uh, 12 to 24 months that is around 1 to 2 years now uh, on prolonged usage this is known to increase the progesterone receptors this causes a feedback inhibition thereby decreasing the gonadotropin uh, expression and uh, thereby reducing the estradiol level. So it not just causes hyperprogesterogenic effect but also causes hypoestrogenic environment. When this type of environment is created, it decreases the endometriotic lesions and thereby provides pain relief uh, in the cases of endometriosis. Uh, remember that it also decreases the principal uh, cytokines which are released that is it reduces the inflammatory uh, uh, chemical mediators in the uh, body. So in a nutshell it is anti-proliferative, anti-angiogenic, anti-inflammatory properties and it is a pro-progesterogenic effect. Apart from management of endometriosis, Dynogis is also used in combination with ethanide estradiol in combined ossicles. Uh, remember that the one which is popularly used in uh, combined ossicles is a form of low dose uh, uh, ossicle, okay, because of the low dosage of the estrogen that is present, that is 30 micrograms. Also remember that uh, this uh, Dynogis has to be used in a uh, uh, form of once daily tablet over a period of 12 to 24 months but uh, you should ex uh, always see the patient profile when you are dealing in uh, with the case of endometriosis what is the age of the patient what is her primary concern whether her uh, primary concern is pain or it is infertility uh, or uh, she is asymptomatic and she has come for you for infertility so it's very important to uh, give it in a uh, after give it after seeing the patient profile so uh, this is in a nutshell about dynogest any other drug which you want to know uh, do write in the comment section i'll be glad to help you